wondering if you're a future superstar in real estate? Give me 30 seconds and I can tell you for sure whether you are or not. The most predictive way to know whether your future in real estate is going to be successful is to look at what you're doing on a daily basis. If you give me just a few minutes to look at your day plan or see the calls you're making, who it is you're talking to, I can pretty well tell you really quick whether you're going to have success in the future and the amount of success you're going to have in the future. So what I want to do today is I want to go through three different types of people that you should have on your day planner that you're talking to on a daily basis. When you look at these things, it's going to give you the opportunity to know for sure that your success is imminent in this business. The first group of people that we want to make sure you've got on your day planner is past clients. Do you have a time where you've blocked it off to make sure that you're talking to past clients? Do you have appointments set to meet with past clients, to go to lunch, to just check in with them, to send them emails, to send texts? You see, when we focus on our past clients, these are people that already know, like, and trust you. These are people that have done business with you in the past, and they're not just there where you have the potential to do business with them again. Now you have a place where you can get referrals, friends, family members that they can refer to you to help grow your business. The second group of people that we need to make sure of that we have on our schedule on a daily basis that we have time blocked off for are our present clients. These are people that are either under contract, we have a listing for, or that we're in the middle of negotiating or showing them property to get to a point of a contract. You see, these are critical times. These are times when relationships are really built. This is the time when they need us the most. This is the time when we need to make sure that we keep in touch with them on a daily basis, that we have consistent follow-up, that we make sure we stay ahead of the curve as far as keeping in touch with them during the process. When we do this, it drives our relationship deeper. It gives us the ability to know that the things that we're doing right now are going to get closed or that are going to go under contract. And it also gives us the ability to have the foundation so that the people we were talking about in the past clients, when we call them, they've got a great feeling and understand how we do business. Third group is future clients. Who are you spending time with on a daily basis that will be your next clients? These are people that maybe you're adding to your database by making sure you're doing circle prospecting. Maybe these are people that you're meeting at open houses. These are people that are referred to you. See, these are people that we're building the opportunity for future business with. These are people that maybe not ready now, but when the time comes, you're going to be top of mind. You see, if we touch our past clients, if we're working steadily with our current clients, if we're also building new relationships with future clients, I promise your business is going to grow. Listen, if you're enjoying these videos and you're seeing this on YouTube, make sure you hit the subscribe button. It's going to give you the ability to get notified every time that we put a new video up. I hope you're getting value from this. If I can help in any way, don't hesitate to reach out and I'll talk to you soon. Yeah.